Hey Jeff, it's Stan at RV1. How are you? I promised you a video, sir. And here you go, the Free Solo DIN. Now you know it only weighs about 2,400 pounds. It's got extra heavy duty off-road tires on it. Plenty of clearance underneath. A rack on the front for a generator. Now I brought in my Honda 2000 generator and it ran everything in the unit. The AC, the microwave, everything just perfectly. This 18 foot trailer has all the things that the bigger one has. It has stabilizer bars. It has a gray tank, a black tank, a fresh water tank. And for a little trailer, it sure has a lot of room. Look at the size of this dinette that converts into a sleeper. Your kitchen is along here with your two burner stove. Microwave up top. There's your 5K AC. Certainly enough power to chill this down. And you've got a three way fridge. That means it's gonna operate when you're plugged in at campsite, or it's gonna operate off of your propane, or it'll operate off your battery if you're not plugged in at all. An enclosed toilet and shower. And forward is your queen size bed. With plenty of windows on both sides, letting in all the light. Shelf over the top has a Bluetooth stereo that connects to your speakers in the ceiling. And this is a 12 volt fan also connected to your battery. So if you're not plugged in, this will certainly work for you. Get out all the hot air. And there's plenty of hot water for that shower operated by your water heater that is both electric as well as propane. And there you see your 110 outlet. And here's a look again at the convertible dinette that converts into a bed. Plenty of room for an adult and lots of room for a little one. A couple of extra features. You have a hot and cold shower on the outside here, and also you are solar ready. You get a little ZAMP panel, plug it in, point it up to the sun, and that's gonna charge your battery for you. That way you can operate that refrigerator or that 12 volt ceiling fan. So I know you've been busy, but I know you're very interested in this. So I'm here for you. Stan at RV1 here in St. Augustine. Hopefully I'll see you in the next couple of days.